We are so pleased now to welcome our next guest who faced down tragedy when their daughter, 1994 Notre Dame graduate Melissa Cook, was killed after a piece of scaffolding fell from Chicago's John Hancock Center in 2002. Ever since, Paul and Linda Demo have worked to keep their daughter's memory and legacy alive through their relationship with her alma mater, the University of Notre Dame. Paul and Linda, thank you so much for being here and welcome to Notre Dame Day. Hi. Hi. Thank you for being here. Tell us a little bit, if you could, about your daughter, Melissa, and her journey to Notre Dame. Uh, Melissa was a very, um, no, excuse me. Uh, she was a lively child and uh, she loved Notre Dame and the whole family loved Notre Dame. And it just seemed a natural thing for her to do to um, go to Notre Dame. And um, she, she loved every minute of her four years here. Well, in the aftermath of Melissa's death, an accident which also injured you, Linda, how did the Notre Dame family rally around you? You know, it was amazing, and I, I, didn't, I didn't really understand the meaning of Notre Dame being a family until that day. And I'm... I'm absolutely positive that I don't think I would have made it without the closeness of all of her friends who actually took care of us and are still taking care of us. They never, um, they, they never have a time go by that they don't contact us or send us uh, a, a greeting. So it's like we have, we still have a little bit of Melissa with us. Well, that's wonderful. Uh, with funds from the accident settlement, you contributed a $3 million gift for the construction of a new softball stadium to be named in your daughter's honor. What inspired both of you to put the money to use in this way? And how does Melissa Cook Stadium reflect her passions? You know, when, when um, there's a very tragic death, people don't want to say that person's name. And I, I had done the same thing before Melissa Cook passed away. And we wanted to have her remember. And the settlement actually was the way we believe was the money that Melissa had. She, she paid the ultimate price for that money. So we wanted to make sure that she... Money wasn't wasted. Money wasn't wasted and it was, it was something to pay tribute to her because she was, she was a, a fun child, but she was an awesome adult with a kind heart. Uh, quickly, let me just tell you that the very last thing she did in that car before the uh, accident was she sent a woman across the street and saved her life. So that I have that beautiful memory of Melissa's last act on this earth was a kind one. So the Melissa Cook Stadium has become more than a stadium. Mm -hmm. The Melissa Cook Stadium is has been our purpose in life, hasn't it? Yep. We, the happiness and the joy that we get from the girl, the coaches, everything is just, it makes our life world worthwhile. So inspiring to hear her selfless act. Uh, you used another part of the settlement uh, to launch the Melissa Cook Foundation. What was the foundation's mission? The, the foundation's mission was to help uh, young students get to college and have a, a full college experience, the, the um, campus and the, the uh, university itself. So we did that for quite a few years, but um, we 
after a while, one of our, our board members, one of our important ones, uh, moved to Australia and it just became too much for us to do. So we decided to uh, give the foundation to Notre Dame. And we uh, specified that the uh, funds would be for Northwest Indiana children, uh, students. And uh, that's what they have done. And, and that is a beautiful thing for us because we get these wonderful letters from the students who have from Notre Dame, uh, from Notre Dame that have uh, uh, gotten the scholarships. It must be incredible, Paul and Linda, to, to see those letters, to see firsthand how you are impacting, how Melissa's legacy is impacting these students. Sometimes we even go to lunch with them. And it really is, it's remarkable talking to them. What does it mean to both of you to see Melissa's legacy and impact continue uh, at Notre Dame today? You know, when we go to the softball game and they said we're playing here at Melissa Cook Stadium, the both of us still just absolutely can't get over it. It makes us so happy. And uh, the, the coaches are wonderful and they have kept Melissa's story alive. Um, I have to tell you that, that there's a, a relief in the uh, stadium of Melissa and the lady that takes care of the stadium at night puts flowers there for her. I mean, it's just everybody feels like it's a special place. Well, I can't tell you what it means to us to have you join us here today and to share Melissa's legacy with the entire university community. She will always be an important member of no the Notre Dame family. And we are so grateful for all you have done for Notre Dame in her honor. She's where she loved the most. Paul and Linda, thank you so much for joining us here tonight. Thank you. Thank you.